What's going on YouTube? It's your boy Taylor and yes, I'm in my garage, but I I needed to make this video because I've been waiting for this day for such a long time. I've been feeling like a painter without a paintbrush or a singer without a voice or soup that's just too hot. I've been feeling uncomfortable and it all has to do with me wanting to make films and not having a camera to do so. Well, what do you mean, Taylor? You have a camera right here that you're shooting this with. It's true. I do have a camera, but not one that I would say is my pride and passion to be shooting film with. Now, in the words of the great Casey Neistat, it doesn't matter what equipment you have or what camera you're using. Story. Story is all that matters. Story is golden. As long as the content is good, the story that you're telling is solid, it doesn't matter what you're shooting with. And I, and I totally agree. But there are some things that little point and shoot cameras like this one, like this one, which is the Canon G7X Mark II, can not do. And you have to admit that some of the camera rigs that people have been making these days are so undeniably gorgeous. And for people with low budgets like myself, there's no way I can just go and spend three or four grand on a camera and rig and go start filming. So I did what any smart, financially savvy person would do, and I saved my money, and I got myself a credit card. And from there, it was easy. I headed straight to Amazon the next day, and found myself a camera I liked, and bought it. The hard part was choosing all the right camera parts to make your rig. Half the things I was looking at, I had no idea what they did. But I was eager to build my first rig. So I, I found the parts that I thought would work, I ordered them, and they arrived today. Now all I have to do is actually put it together. Let's do this. What is your definition of happiness? happiness. A clear horizon. Nothing to worry about on your plate. Only things that are creative and not destructive.
All right, now that you guys know what parts I'm using to build the rig, let's roll up our sleeves and actually build it. Now to put on this hood, I have to find the right padding for the lens to fit through it. Oh, that was easy. HDMI port. The heck? Is this H? Are you HDMI? Oh geez, I should have looked at this beforehand. How does this work? All right, I think I'm done, at least for now. I made a huge mess of the entire place, but I did it. I built my first rig, <laughs> yeah! guys it's finally done all that hard work paid off and I uh, I could say I built my first camera rig and I'm freaking stoked yee this thing is freaking awesome it's also heavy as f but this is mainly going on a tripod and when I need to uh, hand hold it I'll probably get one of those gimbal vests that go over the head and help you hold it so it's not so heavy but for the most part this thing is freaking awesome um, I think I'll always be adding on to it, but for now, definitely worth the investment. So, thanks for watching, guys. And hopefully that inspired you all to go out and get your own. And, uh, I have to tell you that it's, it's definitely an awesome feeling. So, thanks for tuning in, and I'll see you guys in the next video.